All right, welcome guys here in Koh Lanta. Anyway, we're out exploring and I wanted to stop and check this out. We got some uh, jackfruit here. There's a rubber plantation behind me. There's bananas, papaya, all kinds of stuff. So there's palms and there was some guys out cutting the, the big uh, purple things off the palm trees to um, take them in and process it to uh, palm oil. So let's check this out before we go over to where we're headed. So this is a rubber plantation. You can see they plant all the trees in a row. But what I thought was cool was the uh, jackfruit. And the jackfruit's pretty small yet. And you can see it growing right up the, uh, the tree. And these things get massive. And then right next to it, we got some banana trees. Let's look at those. Here you have the bananas. And you'll see them, they'll have a humongous bloom and they'll cut that bloom and they'll, they'll uh, eat that bloom and everything. And then they use the banana leaves. They uh, cut those and then they'll use it for uh, putting like food on. Like when you order like uh, food from a restaurant, like a pow or something like that, they'll put that right on the banana leaf. And right here, you can see how they process the rubber. So they cut the bark back and then the uh, sap comes out and it runs right, right along and they have this little metal thing and it drips right into these. And they'll come and they'll gather these up like in the evening or at night when it's not so hot and then they'll uh, process it into the sheets of rubber. Here's a great look at the uh, the bloom. You see that big purple thing? That's the big bloom. And then the bundle of bananas. And another one. Just massive amounts of bananas that come off these trees. Hey guys, we're gonna check out something I haven't seen before. Just saw this uh, driving along. So we're gonna see that one of the uh, Sea Gypsies cemeteries. So let's take a look. I thought this was interesting. I was driving along and I saw this sign. It says Plow Han Sai. And it's just out here in the middle of nowhere. The road just goes down through, kind of going along the coast. And uh, what this is, this is like the Sea Gypsies Cemetery. And uh, they believe in being buried close to the sea. The Sea Gypsies are uh, like an indigenous group of people that were living here before the Chinese came and before the Muslims and everybody came. And they speak a different language and uh, they're not Thai. But anyway, they have some uh, cemeteries that they like to be buried next to the ocean. And so right down here off the cliff is this. And then they come out here on like the, uh, the full moon of the fifth lunar month and they dance from like uh, nine until five or so. And uh, they, they believe that if they're happy, that the ancestors are happy and then they clean up the cemetery and uh, they go about their lives. They have a big feast. So they've built their cemetery just like this, which is quite a bit different than you normally see. The, the ties normally cremate the bodies. And they have a picture of uh, their ancestor. They have all these little flags and stuff on it. Yeah, this is definitely different. You'll see the Chinese that will bury on the hills, like overlooking a river. But this is uh, right next to the ocean. Some more of the graves. They built these little awnings over them and stuff. And then here's the ocean, just right next to it. And they have graves all through the, the trees here. Yeah, very interesting. Looks like a couple of the graves are fairly new. Just uh, right here amongst the trees. All different sizes and shapes of them. And then the ocean. And they believe that the sound of the waves makes them happy. So when they're buried, they still get to hear the sound of the waves. So I guess this would be a pretty fitting place if you spent your whole life you know, working on the, on the water fishing, doing all of that, that you're buried right next to the shore. And you might as well enjoy a brilliant view like this in the afterlife, right? And yeah, they got these red, white, and blue flags. I have no idea what they mean. Something different. Well, this is new. I've never seen or uh, heard about this before. So it's something, uh, something I learned about. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. All right, that was just a short little video. All right, I hope you like that. If you do, subscribe, share, and like, and all that. And until next time, life is a journey. 
Enjoy, guys.